Hey, we are here with Bob, Notorious B. O. B. Please check his channel out. I'll put it in the descriptions. Uh, but we are here at Saki's. Never been here? Never been here. I, I, I already talked good about them, so uh, they they have some really good food. I've been here a few times, did a couple videos already. Uh, but we're going to do a review with Bob for his first time and see how he likes it. See you inside. As we're walking in here, I would like to um, shout Philip Wolf and Michelle Wolf out, members of the disposal team that actually told me about this place, uh, I would say three or four or five months ago. I'm glad they did. I've been here over nine or 10 times since then. Bob has never been here, but I'm gonna tell you now, very, very, very good. And hopefully it meets up with Bob's expectation of me telling him that this place is very good. Um, please check the video out of the sakis that I've done before if you haven't already. And enjoy the video. Too many awkward moments that the, the music's going to be copyrighted. Yeah. I got the mail. Sure. Okay, look at mine. Okay, I'm going to have to do different. I don't know, I don't want to do exactly the same for yours and mine. Yeah. All good? Okay, I thought I saw this. You put the video up twice. <laughs> Okay. Right, here we are at Saki. We're starting with every appetizer they have. So we have 14 different appetizers. And we also got all of their soups, five different soups, 19 items, one still coming out. Let's get started. I'm not a big, uh, well, you know what? You want me to do mine real quick? Sure. Um, you know what? I'll just use yours. Is that okay? Sure. You're not going to copyright me? Uh, you can freely use it. Okay. You heard that. Okay. Well, um, I just got an empty bowl because I just want to try a little bit. I'm not a real big soup person. I'm not going to even try the egg soup. I'm sorry. I just don't do that one. Okay. That's like pickle pig's feet for me. I'm not a fan of That's another thing people, a fun fact, people know about me now. Pickles, pigs, pickle. Well, they know about that. They don't know on my channel. They don't know about the egg drop soup. Okay. I'm not a gotcha. fan of it. Okay. Well, um, what do you want to try? We can have a... We're just, we're just going to kind of try everything and see how it goes. Yeah. If you guys didn't know, this is all you can eat. Uh, they got a dinner um, They got a dinner menu and they got a dinner all you can eat menu, but they also have a lunch and an all you can eat lunch. Um, they have, uh, these are regular servings. When I come here, usually I get like 16 of these, but usually if you do it, if you don't eat it, you pay extra because you don't want you to waste food. Because some people do that. Sure. You heard about people do that? I heard. I haven't seen it myself. Yeah. Never happened to me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, um, what do you want to try? I'm going to start with the crab. Well, I guess I'll do the okay. same. And they got different sauces with all of them, too. Mm. I really like that. It's lightly fried. This is made to order. But uh, usually when you get it on, like on a buffet, it's really hard and crunchy. This is this is pretty good. I, I, I dig this because you go to a buffet, you don't know how long the food's on there. This one, you know how long the food's. It's from there to here. Right. It's from there. You can't see right there, but it's only like, what, 100 feet, 75 feet to here. That's about cold as it is. Now, do you want the other one? Or are you are you really into that or, you, or not? Um, I can go ahead. I mean, right. you did it. I have to. There we go. Mm -hmm. One day. What are we do next? We split this. This right. is a uh, tempura battered. Yeah, so this is uh, shrimp. <laughs> yeah, I snuck in a bump. What? This is, is this fried shrimp? This is fried shrimp. Yeah. I think. Doesn't doesn't that doesn't. That's a long good. shrimp. Yeah. It's long. That's what she said. I'm not sure what that one is. <laughs> well, we'll have to ask when she comes with the chicken nugget. Mm. 
זה משהו, אמרת שהוא אדם על ראש. What is that? It's like a fish. Yeah, it's like some kind of fish. I don't think it's shrimp though. Oh my gosh, it's fried, fried scallop? No. No. Fried scallop is right here. Yeah. Toss me, just a, toss me just a spoonful of uh, soup. What kind of soup? Whatever that is. What is, is in this? front of you? Is that wonton soup? Mm -hmm. I'll take a wonton too. How about that? How about that? I'm not, I'm not big on, on soups, guys, all. So. Okay. Mm. Actually, it's not too bad. I'm just not, I'm just not a big soup guy. Mm. Maybe chicken noodle soup. I'm not fancy. I, I like soup, especially in the winter. And this is what I expect wonton soup to taste like. I just never order it because the egg drop soup messed it up for, for, for me. Kind of like okra in um, gumbo. It's slimy. Like I don't like my own like okra in my gumbo. Oh, thank you very much. Hey, what was that long tempura batter deal? Uh, that's chicken tempura. Chicken tempura. Yeah. Okay. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Do you want another order? Um, no, just the sushi stuff. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Welcome. Thank you. So the chicken nuggets um, can almost, well the scallops are, are pretty much circle. Well, that is a large bowl of soup for all you can eat. Yeah, so some people that say, hey, this is skimpy, you can keep ordering as much as you want, but they don't want you to waste it. But they, they, they prepare this for you just that amount. So they'll do it over and over again as well. Yeah, I was about to say, hey, yeah, please. <laughs> is egg drop soup here? You sure you don't want any? I, I'm going to pass on that. It's good. You like it? Mm -hmm. I like soup though. I, I really like soup. I see. And he ordered all the soups. He said, give me all five soups you have. Mm -hmm. uh, but he also did get the uh, miso soup, the clear soup, and the uh, hot and sour soup as well. They got salads as well on here, and we didn't even get to the entrees yet, uh, or no. even the um, the uh, sushi. They're gonna bring the sushi out and place it on the table beside us, and we'll probably cut in between here and go ahead and um, set up the table for the sushi as well. So it's gonna be my video is gonna be like an hour or something probably. Yours is like ten. Uh, who knows? I might do a mukbang with this. This is the chicken nuggets. Since this is hot, I'm gonna just have one of these. Ooh. It is warm. I like the fried coating on all this stuff. Yeah, they have some different, um, and, and the different sauces too. Yeah, I like that light batter. Want that one? Go ahead. I'll, I'll go ahead on this one. You guys are right. next second. All right. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I'll clear my side out. There All you right. go. Uh, shrimp. Fried shrimp here. I really like the coating. Oh dang, there was no cocktail sauce with that one. No. Okay. Guys, I don't know if you know what this is. I don't know if they see that ring. <laughs> I think he knows what I'm doing. I know what he's doing. So are you a flat or a, a, a drip? No, go ahead. I was just, just a little comment for these guys that they can do in comments. If you're a flat or a drum you know, like guy. Flat? Or drums, but he is the he, I'm the Memphis Wing Champ, um, but this guy's the Philadelphia Wing Champ. So you might want to play. 
close attention to what he's doing. <laughs> I like that win. I wouldn't want to order a lot of them just because there's so many other foods to eat. But I'm glad we tried it. It's definitely a good wing. It's a good wing. I think it's just the, the crust on the, the crunchiness. I wouldn't want to eat a lot of them because it's kind of crunchy. Right. Oh, yeah. It's much too. It's like doing a cereal uh, challenge. Oh, it would, it would tear you. <laughs> but it is good. I like it because it's not soggy. A lot of wings you get sit while for a while and they're soggy. Which one are you gonna try now? Dumplings. Okay. Oh, this is. I always call these pot stickers, but they're uh, called gazoya. dim sums. What are they called? Gazoya. Oh, gazoya. I call them. Twi I, I say the wrong thing twice then. Mm. It's my turn, so. What's the difference between pot stickers, dim sums, and these then? Because they all look the same to me. I don't think there is. Maybe you guys in the comments can let me know. We are working our way through plates. Okay. You want to try another soup or do you want to go to. That one is a spring roll? Spring roll, sure. It has some good sauce. I'm, I'm going to say it over and over again. Mm. Wow. You see why I ordered 16 of these when I come in? I can in? totally see. This is my favorite of all the appetizers we had so far. First thing I order is this. I say I want 16. They look, and if they don't know me like a new waitress, they're like, are you sure? That mm. was good. Okay. That is uh, fried scallops. Shallops, scallops, yeah. Scallops. Scallops. I'm sorry. I had a brain fart there. I had to hold my head like still because I got to put that thing in there now if I remember the little uh, brain fart deal. These are definitely good. I just, <clears throat> I wouldn't order fried food in any kind of quantity when you're doing all you can eat. Yeah. It does tear you up after a while. Okay. Well, this ain't fried. What is this called? That is shrimp. Shrimp. Is that coconut? Shumai. S H U M A I. I'll show you guys what it is before you dig in. Uh, I didn't know if I want to. I'll go. Shumai. S H U M A I. Something like that. Oh wow, yeah. look at yeah. you. See? Culture. Let's say I'm disrespecting by using the fork. Try it without. I'm be disrespectful if I dump all the food on the ground for using those. True. Yeah. Oh, I'll show them. I do know how to use them. They, they gotta see this. You guys didn't think I was lying. I work on some of the soup that winter. You're doing that. Look at that. Now that's. Mm. I use chopsticks. This is miso. The miso is very good. Love miso soup. Even though there's nothing in it, like much there, it's good flavor. Miso reminds me of a song. Very controversial in Walmart when it first came out. Two Live Crew. I know what you're talking about. Yes. And it probably went in the video. Just a short, short four <laughs> seconds. So she said. Okay. All right, let's, let's try to get. Oh, yeah, that looks lovely. Like so this is. Like onion? Is that an onion ring? Vegetable combo combo tempura. You want a half that onion ring or? or? You can have it. Okay, because you guys know I already saw that. I, oh, oh, whoops. So there's a broccoli, the broccoli. Cute, uh, zucchini, or yeah, onion and. Is that potato or that? Oh, this onion ring is going to be good. The broccoli was good. I'll 
take this guy, which is looks like a carrot. Mm. Mm. Very delicious. Everything has been great so far. But surprising, these spring rolls are still yeah, still my top. Go ahead, whatever you want to do. Try shrimp? Sure. This is fried shrimp. You show your people? Mm. You show your people? Forgot. Oh. It's like salt and pepper it's shrimp, ain't it? Good. Oh, is this, just, oh, this is salt and pepper. Yeah, this is okay. fried shrimp. This is salt and pepper shrimp. Yeah, I'm a fan of these. Mm. I guess you really don't need dipping sauce for this. For the other one, I would like like cocktail sauce with the, the other fried shrimp. Yes, that would have been good. The bite of that like cocktail sauce is what does it for me on that. But these have a really good taste. You want that one? Go ahead. You, you like it? You okay. I asked once. Let's go with some ordinary. These look like, kind of like to me. You ever had rallies or checkers where you're at? No. Rallies or checkers? No. no. Just the batter on these kind of remind me of those. It's not exactly like it. Like a seasoned coated uh, fry. Kind of reminds me of a Rallies. Okay. Rallies and Checkers, same same place. They just changed the name. They're definitely different fries. The, the coating on it is different, but it's not as seasoned as I thought it would. Yeah, it's not. It doesn't have. This doesn't have seasoning on it. I thought it would have a little bit. But it looks like it does. Yeah. So the seasoning is not in the coating. Mm -mm. Mm. Mm. Now catch up. So if you if you're like if you don't like a lot of season on your fries, you would like these. Or you get a little trick that some people do, put salt inside the ketchup and dip the ketchup like that. Salt inside the ketchup. Yeah. Or because some people don't like to put ketchup all on their fries and then salt it so the salt sticks to the ketchup and it, it makes the fries soggy. So if okay. you do it like that, you can just dip it each one. Okay, what kind of peas are these? The this tofu. is endamame. End, endamame? What'd you call them, mama? Yeah. <laughs> these are going to take a little while to work through. Do you supposed to peel these? You should just be able to pop them. Oh. Okay. So, I'm not a fan of doing the work. No. So, I think we're going to probably... Eat some of these, but uh, they're not bad, but they're just not. Well, I really enjoy them. You feel like something healthy, kind of healthy, toward the healthy side here. Yeah, we eat these all the time at home. Do you? Mm -hmm. I call them snow peas. They're not snow peas? No. No? Mm -mm. I, never, I never even had them. You ever I mean, had these? Oh, they're not bad. I like the coating on the outside here. Mm hmm. They're seasoning, but inside they're bland. Well, the the actual thing you're eating yeah, is kind of it tastes healthy. It's not a lima bean. It's approaching lima bean. Like, you know how lima bean doesn't have like a lot of flavor. That was my number one thing when I was younger. I wouldn't eat lima beans. I had to sit at the table for two hours. My stepmom, yes. I think I won because I didn't eat any lima beans, but I went to the room. Stood my ground. I hope, we, should we just eat them all or? Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't want to waste them. But we'll eat them all. 
I'm not a fan of sunflower seeds either. It's like eating crawfish, too much work. Mm -hmm. Like crab legs. I still don't know what the big hype on crab legs are. You like crab legs? Only the big crab, the expensive crab, not king crab, not like the small crab. Go to crab seller. Yeah, a video I did there. It's a little pricey, but they get filet mignon too. All you can eat if you upgrade. You don't need to upgrade here because they have all this on the same menu. This is tofu. Tofu. Here he goes with his fancy chopsticks. I'm gonna dump that all over. Oh. If I use my chopstick. There we go. I've eaten a lot of tofu. I don't recall being this crunchy. It is crunchy. But you usually don't have to fry it, so. Okay. This and the green bean things, I probably wouldn't order another. Right. I would say, hey, bring some of them crab, uh, them spring rolls. Spring rolls still best so far for you? I think so. What's your favorite so far? Spring rolls? You want some more of those? Oh, you're going to have some soup? Yeah, just a couple. It's called clear, clear soup. This is the clear soup. Well, that's be Cahokia water then. Just how clear Cahokia water is. Yeah. Place to live, folks. I don't think I've ever had this before. It, interesting flavor. There's mushrooms in it. Let's just taste some mushrooms. I'll eat these while he's eating those. Want this soup? Um, this is sure. The hot and sour. Yep. And after this soup, we'll get uh, this table set up here in a second of uh, all the uh, sushis they have to offer. Or most of them. You got half of them? or Yeah, we got a lot of different sushis, mainly yeah. the fried ones. Yeah, there's a lot of them they have. This is called hot and sour or sweet and sour? Hot and sweet? Sweet and hot? Hot and sour. Hot and sour. It's not bad. Mm. There's a little spice there, but it's not as far from anything anybody can handle this. Yeah, I but like it's, it's I nice. like I like it spicy like this. I don't like it too hot when I'm trying to eat food. I like tasting everything in it. <clears throat> oh. Maybe I'll put my chopstick down before I kill my kill my eyeball. Okay. All right, so before we clear this out, I'm going to go with a definitely a spring roll. It's not even close. Number one. Yeah, number one for me. Like, not, I mean, it's not even anywhere close. <laughs> it's just the, not that the summer was bad. It was, it's that good. Um, I'm going to go with the crab rangoon then, second. That is good. Um, I'm, I like the shrimp that they had last. It's salt and pepper the shrimp. Salt and pepper as well. shrimp. They were good. There's there, there's quite a few uh, like that's a, a tie then because it's it's a lot of good food here. The the ones that I wouldn't probably lower would be the, the last the, the tofu fried tofu, the beans, uh, the chicken was good. Uh, it's just the the hard hard the harder batter on it, but it real it's still good. I just wouldn't order ample amount of those. Yeah, I'm 99.99% sure that endamame is soybeans. Soybeans? Yeah. Okay. Uh, just a different name. Okay. Well, I would rather say well, soybeans. When I was in Japan, <laughs> that amount of endamame would probably have been about 
15 to 20 yeah. US dollars. Oh, wow. Insane. Really? I have no idea why it's so expensive there, but and well, you, you only get probably like five or six of those pods for, oh. for five, it's almost a dollar pod. Wow. That is, uh, it's high. You get a dollar, it's high. I, I think a dollar a chicken wing is high. When yeah. People sell 10 for 10, like that's high. Wow. That's not a good deal. All right, so let's get this cleaned up. We'll be right back, guys. Okay, we are here. I'm back with the uh, sushi rolls. We have a lot of different varieties. Uh, what um, what do we all have here? We have all the the tempura, right? All the tempura and frieds. All the fried. Excuse me. We have all the fried rolls they have, and then we ordered some additional ones like volcano roll, Fuji roll, top of the world, and crunchy two in one. I'm not sure. Crunchy two and one. I might can. I think that that one. Crunchy yeah, two. that's that's crunchy two and one. But I'm a fan of the. I like the the fried. What's this one here? So Is it Fuji? I think it's either. There's avocado in it and stuff. It looks not. It looks Fuji very delicious. Volcano. I think it's volcano. My guess is volcano. Okay. Okay. Well. You good. Oh, I don't have a fork. Oh, you lost. I always have to do. American there style. There you go. Finger licking good. All right. Okay, where are we going? I'm gonna go with. It's just digging wherever you want to. You know what? I'll be, I'm gonna get. Go ahead. I'm gonna give you a fork. And I have a fresh pair of chopsticks just in case what I need do. Them. Okay. All right. Just digging. I guess wherever you want to. Let's just try. This. I'm gonna try this. Serious. All serious aside. No, all oh, jokes time. aside. All jokes aside. Do I need a rubber band? Is that how you practice? <laughs> what do you think? I like, I like it. Is that like a spicy mayo on top? Yeah, which makes me think that might be the volcano. Okay. Let me try one more volcano. Yeah, that's volcano. Crab meat on top. I thought you were a Miracle Whip guy. I am. I know they use spicy uh, mayo, but actually the spice they put in there is, I, I like it. It'll probably be better with Miracle Whip. Mm -hmm. You want to keep, can you reach it? Yeah, I can reach it. There we go. I'm getting the hang of it now. You got it. Mm. Oh, shoot. Oh, oh. I got the end piece as the tail. Is this just uh, kimchi or cabbage or what's ginger? That's ginger probably. You're supposed to ginger. cleanse your palate. So I'm going to cleanse my palate with this one. I use the diet Pepsi. Yeah. I'm, I like the pickled uh, ginger, I really do. Okay, we should, if we're... Can you share it? There you go, that'll work. Okay. Uh, You're not an end piece on these? You Bam, to look at that. I know. <laughs> Silly American. <laughs> Mm, that's good. This is really good. Wow, there is a good level of spice in there. Really good. We're getting suited up for our, our trip because we're actually going to be doing, if we can get an appointment, um, the SNJ. It's $2,000. We can say that because this video is not out until afterwards. We're going to try it. $2,000. Yeah, we'll give it a try. $2, I don't know about the PlayStation, though, but it's $2,000. Nice. If you can, if you can do it. 
You can have that one. This is your thing. No, go ahead. You got it. You got it. You're closer. I'll, I'll eat it. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm going to have some ginger. Put some wasabi. Too much, wasn't it? That was... That was actually very good. I, I thought I liked the volcano. I yeah. did like the volcano. But that, the second one... You want to go there and just come this way? Okay. And, uh... Oh, yeah, thank, that's perfect. Thank, thank you so you, much. Thank you. We got entrees to go after this. We're going to be entrees. So we're going to try all these. Um, oh, I have to have one of these though. Yes. Thank you. We're definitely, thank you very much. Look at, we got some more spring rolls. Yes, yeah, since those are so good, we had to get some more. This is, this is crunchy two in one, and this has a good spice to it. Oh, right. you're warning yeah. me? Ah, I think it's good. It's not, it's flavorful. Heat. I like the flavorful heat. I don't like the, the crazy manly. I'm a man heat type thing. Yeah, this is good. Just a little spicier than the other one, but it's still good. Man, I told you. I, I'm glad. I'm glad you're liking this place because I bragged about it all the way here. This is really good. Mm. So you want that one or me? That's you. Okay. These are all about the same to me, it looks, but. Yeah, I'm not sure what this one is. Mm. These are just like almost, without the coating, it's like melting your mouth. Mm -hmm. If the coating wasn't there, yes. But the coating, I, li I like the coating on all these. That's an eel sauce, ain't it? I think this is eel sauce. It is good. It looks like it, yeah. I have to have eel sauce when I go uh, places. Usually I get a, a whole dipping thing, but forgot all about it. <laughs> Oh, that's my fault. Should use a fork. <laughs> do you? I mean, do you like? Do you like using uh, chopsticks when you go places? Yeah, it's something different to do. Plus, it slows down my eating. You know what? That is a good idea. Maybe if Tasha watches my video, she might buy me chopsticks to eat at home. See? Huh? Okay. This just slapped me for using it like that. It's a hefty little size here. Oh, that's good, huh? I don't know what this pink stuff is. I don't know either. I saw that in something else. But I'm getting the end pieces because I noticed he's going for the centers. And I don't mind the end piece on these. Thank you. All right. Maybe a fork time. We get my, my palate cleanser. And get that wasabi. Mm. Okay. That looks almost the same as the other one. What was the other one? Volcano, you said, or? That's how. Now that's the crunch one here. Maybe this a might Fuji. Be top of the world. Top of the world. Oh yes. Yeah, I don't care what you try here. You're gonna you're gonna leave out here happy. Mm. You're doing pretty good with the chopsticks. I am. I'm trying. I 
I just like resting it on there. Like a forklift. Oh, I have to bring um, Tasha back something to eat too. Strawberry would be a little bit bigger there. Yeah, I'm not using the ginger, but that spice is starting to build up a little bit. Yeah? Not, not a bad way. It's good. It tastes good. Do, do you want the pickle ginger? No. Does it help out on that? Well, no. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling the, the, I feel the, the, the heat coming in there. That's just, it's building up. All the food so far, I've really enjoyed now, some stuff I wouldn't order because we're trying as many things as possible here. But something else. That's, that's, that's the endamame. I, I, I feel like at home, but I would, I would never order that out. Yeah, I, I wouldn't order any. I mean, I would just, I just, whatever's up on the buffet, they usually don't have the good stuff up there on buffet. It's usually sitting out. It's usually sitting out for a long time, too, when you go to a buffet. Mm hmm. This is nice that you just order and they make it right for you. Plus, you don't have to get up, they bring it to your table. Yeah. Mm. Tell you what, none of these are disappointing so far. I always get these fried ones. I tell them I want everything fried. But now I'll get some stuff not fried that I'm not used to getting because they, those are pretty good too. Oh. Mm. I was putting this on this side because it has the ginger. Oh, oh, oh man, I'm crushing this one. Oh, you have me spoiled with those fried ones. Those, not that these taste good, but the fried ones taste good. Well, we got some for last there, so we can finish up with some, some the better ones. I mean, they're all good, but the better, the better are the fries. I think so. So everything's better fried. I inhaled that oh. on top. Oh, I breathed some of it in. I do that on um, confectionery sugar. drier than the rest. It definitely is. Here you can see it. We actually have a minimal mess. I'm doing pretty good though. I'm, I'm hanging around with chopsticks. You're doing really good with chopsticks, which I don't understand because you always say you're bad with chopsticks. Like some of these fries though, they almost all about taste the same a little bit. Just that one right there was dry, but they, I can't tell the difference though. I think I'm getting that, that sauce is kind of like, I'm hitting that same flavor from the sauce. I'm, I can't differentiate 
All right, they got the same, same on top. <coughs> I do like that sauce. That was a nice round of maki rolls and their signature rolls. Brandon wanted to get some more of the spring rolls. Try not to repeat and stuff like this, but they were so good the first time. We got some more. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. I don't even know what to tell them about this. It's like cotton candy. It's like cotton candy when you, once you bite it, it's like melting. Oh, that's double dip. The spring well, we're not gonna use it anymore. Oh. The spring roll coating is a lot less hard. It's like softer and easier to eat. It's magical. Yeah, it's it's really good. I don't know how they keep it intact. Mm -hmm. It's like barely there, but it's there. It's like a I taste it like a crisp. Okay, well, on all those, what do you like the best? That one that was real moist, I don't know what that, which one. Mm -hmm. I, can, I don't even know the names of it to tell these fine folks. Yeah, I, I don't know the names, but all those the fried ones were really good. Yeah, even the ones that weren't, whatever the the double crisp one, yeah. and, and we had the other ones that so had, we the had the volcano, crab on the top. Fuji, uh, the crunchy two in one, and top of the world, and enjoyed them unfortunately it's kind of like the appetizers versus the spring roll all the appetizers taste <laughs> good but we, like the spring roll is our favorite and the, the fried ones were our favorite yeah and they all the fried ones like i said taste about almost all the same because the same sauces were on there so but all good okay well i guess we're cleaning the table up a little bit we'll clean the table up and get some entrees all right see you then Okay, you want to go ahead? All right, so we're gonna we got five different entrees to try. We got two things for the hibachi. We have salmon, we have shrimp, we have a teriyaki shrimp dinner, we have coconut shrimp, and we have sweet and sour chicken. And they all have the same rice, so it's all the same. We're gonna yeah. try some of it, but we don't have to eat all the rice right now. But if you're here, um, I would think if you order one of these, they, they want you to eat everything, right? Except the plate. <laughs> what do you want to start with? Doesn't matter to me. Whatever. Let's go with what's in front of you. So this is the shrimp hibachi. Okay. It's got two different sauces. The earthy. Mm. Like an earthy taste? Yeah. I'm going to try out one of the sauces, but I don't know. Um... Yeah, I didn't want to double. That's not a double. Hmm. That's a little different to me. I'm not sure what what actually that sauce there is. I don't know. I, I did the brown sauce. Yeah, I did the brown one. one. I don't know what that was. This right here, I thought I had before that, that I liked better. I don't know. When I first dipped it in there, it's like a coleslaw mixed with like a coconut. I don't yeah, know. I prefer it without the sauce. So yeah, I, just, I, just I think without. Ways without. Yeah. yeah, I think without. But uh, do you want to try some of the rice just to? All right, give the rice a try. Yeah. And all of it, it's the same rice on here. It has the carrots and um, uh, peas and everything in there like usual. I don't think there's nothing fancy about it. Rice. Mm -hmm. 
it's a, a lightly fried fried rice. So let's let's do the the teriyaki shrimp. This one here. Yeah. So then we'll get a little comparison difference between teriyaki okay. and hibachi. It's almost the same. You don't get the earthy, the right. earthy taste to it. I think I prefer the like, teriyaki over the hibachi, the second one here. But it's this close. is the which one? This is uh, teriyaki. You prefer this one? Yeah. But they're kinda, really close. I kind of prefer the other one, the earthy. I like mm -hmm. the like the grill kind of taste to me with the earthy. They're really, really close. Okay. Mm. <clears throat> Excuse me. And this is the tempura battered. This is sweet and sour chicken. Sweet and sour chicken. Oh, that's fluffy. Nice and light. Almost every Chinese buffet I go to. These are hard. Those things are hard. I mean, hard. Yeah, they've but, been sitting out too. But here, you know, again, everything's cooked to order. Yeah, it's fluffy. And it is good. These are, these are really enjoyable to eat. Sometimes they are hard and crunchy. I always pass them up. Mm -hmm. I thought they all tasted like that. Right. If I see them filling it up at a buffet, they then don't you go, go, go for it. it. But if they're sitting there, I definitely pass them up. Good sauce, too. I never ordered that here because I thought it was all hard. Yeah, I don't, I'm not really in that red sauce. Yeah, I, I like the sweet and sour sauce. It's a little, it's different, though. It's not like your normal sweet and sour sauce. Well, I mean, I didn't even try it. I'm just saying in general. Oh. In general, when I eat that, I, I just eat it without the sweet and sour. Okay, next. Try this shrimp? Yeah, I, I was just saving that one for last. All right. I want to see. This is coconut shrimp. Coconut shrimp? And again, this is something else at a regular buffet. I don't I, get until I usually don't get this only because it's covered in, in that. Too much. It's way too much. You I are don't correct. understand why it's drowning in it. This is this is nice. You, I bet you like. You this can one. actually see it. It's usually just a big thing of white. Yeah, you can't see it. It's like they dunked it in a whole thing of miracle whip. Pretty much. That's what it looks like. But this, yes, this is just like it has just enough on it that you get to taste a little bit of sweet, but you can right. actually taste the shrimp. They might be lying about all this good stuff. They might they have to come here and try it. Yeah, come try for yourself. Yeah, disposal team member uh, Jeff Swartz, aka Sports Freak 97. I'm trying to take him here. He keeps dodging me. The guy keeps dodging me. No, he's really busy. Uh, but uh, I want to take him here to eat because this is a really good spot. And I'm glad, I'm glad Bob did oh, have a chance. Nice. He flew a little bit early. So. Brandon, Brandon did not let me down with this one. Okay. This is the uh, sauce is that Ooh. salmon from the hibachi. Oh wow! That's we, nice we, have, we have similar taste buds. Of, of the five entrees we just ordered, this by far is my favorite. This is my favorite, and then it, it might be the, the one that you prefer, the ter teriyaki. I like the hibachi shrimp. Yes, I like the crust on this too. It has a nice little crust. It's not like soggy. Mm. Oh yeah. Getting every bit of more so of that. But typically you have to finish all the food. This is one of the rare times we're not because we're trying to sample so many different items off this menu. And there was a little bit of confusion and we, we, we got the rice with it. The other thing is we wanted to showcase how it actually comes. So we did come here, expect to get it with the rice, mm -hmm. which is good. It's, it's fried rice and sometimes I prefer heavy fried rice if I'm just getting fried rice for dinner. But here I prefer lightly. If I was eating it as a, you know, with other things, 
I prefer it like fried. Light, okay. I, I've never really have it like this. Usually I have it just like the you know boxes, you know. Right. So that if I'm getting takeout, I'm only having fried rice. Okay. I like it heavy fried. Okay. Heavy. Yeah, I like it heavy. Real dark. Fried. This right here, um, and uh, like I said before, if if you order this plate and if you if you leave a lot of food on the table, then that's really shunned the point. Well, against me too, you know, it's shown the point yes. about just wasting food. So if you do waste food, uh, they do charge you for like, say if you ordered 20 spring rolls and you don't eat them all, we have to eat these, okay? If we don't eat these, yeah, they brought some more spring rolls out, so we have to eat them. It's pretty much as we get like a spring roll with every uh, Yeah, it's, it's like a ginger. It's like yeah, ginger. Yeah, this is our palate cleanser. <laughs> I don't know what they're doing back there with this, with this fairy dust. Yeah, so the first one I understand because it was early on in us eating. We've eaten a lot of different food. Yeah. And this still holds. Still. Yeah. This is still. I took that. When I came here, I told you, I ordered 16 of these. Uh -huh. My first. Hold on. Too far. The coating is so strange. It's so light. It almost doesn't make sense how you can bite into it and yeah. the rest of it doesn't fall apart. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. But when I first get here, I order 16 of those, and I, I work around that. I get 16 of those, and then start getting other stuff. So, okay. Well, with that said, guys, I really appreciate you watching the video. I appreciate Bob coming uh, and taking my recommendations. Want to get so, dessert? We have to get. I thought that was oh. dessert, but we we will get dessert too. They have what do they have? I don't know. Might as well get one of everything. Let's, yeah, let's well, try the dessert too. Okay, well, guys, we'll be back with uh, with uh, dessert. I'm not sure what all we're getting, but we'll we'll, we'll see. Probably want everything. Yeah, there's th well, there's three things. So. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, no, that's all. Thank you. Check quick. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. All right, here we go again. We got General Sal's chicken. We got steak, hibachi. Oh, sorry. That's all right. Cut, cut, cut. So we had General Sal's chicken. We had steak, hibachi, and another salmon hibachi. We're not yes. repeating too many things here, but that salmon was so good, we had to give that another try. What do you want to have first here? Um, you know, just, uh, we're gonna go ahead and go, yeah. So this is general chicken? Some people call it Tussauds. Somebody's just, just me. I'm telling you, I like how they cook it, because it's not soggy. It's like, you get that crunch and that little, yeah. like, that crisp. The world of difference between getting this at a buffet you serve yourself and when they cook it for you. Very good. I probably ended up going to eat a little more than meat because Bob, we went ahead and ate the other rice. We didn't, we didn't find it fair to go ahead and keep ordering. So he's going to end up eating this rice and I'll eat some more, a little extra of the meat. Unless he's just really hungry and wants to eat it. If you come here because I recommended it and you say you don't like it, you are freaking drunk. I don't know how you would you couldn't find something. You can't. You might not something might not be your favorite. But it's all good. Delicious. Mm. Okay. We'll just make I'll make another rice pile after we're done this. What is this now? This is steak hibachi. Steak hibachi. I'm still tasting a little to so. 
I need some ginger to break it up. Yeah. I'm getting ginger here. I'm getting the, the kick at the end, a little bit of like a flavor at the end. But that, uh, what to sew is, is where it's at. I would take the steak over. You would? Mm -hmm. Wow, I would take that. Okay. You want some more? I'm not going to make you stop, but I'll eat the rest if we're going to eat the rice. I'll eat the rice. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll have this rice since I like it to sew. You don't have to eat the rice, so I'll eat it. Okay. This is salmon hibachi salmon. Okay. Good. Good. Yeah. Uh, it's, a, it's a fork we haven't used. That one there. Just to make it, we're professional eaters. We really don't care. This is for the camera. Now this is something I wouldn't even attempt with chopsticks. Oh god, that is good. Man, I really like this. Right. This is good stuff here. Mm. Yeah, I'll get a spoon for this one. I like to mix my sauces in with it a little bit, get that juices in there. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Can't wait for dessert. I do a buffet. I get like ten of these at the end. They already, oh, yeah? yeah, they already see that this guy ate this food, and then they see me getting ten of these. They but know you're ice cream like heaven after after eating a challenge. A lot of people, a lot of competitive eaters, go for the ice cream after the challenge. It must like soothe the esophagus or something. It's like I don't know, but it's 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 undescribable once you eat a lot of a lot of foods. It don't really add to your volume because it's like liquids once it melts it's liquidy so it's not like adding you know people think you're eat, actually eating more you're kind of kind of already kind of ink yeah. it's like just drinking a lot of fluids mm -hmm. so. i didn't know until i started eating that you, i mean 20 pounds of fluids is not equal to 20 pounds of food so i would say what 10 pounds of food Maybe even half. Oh yeah, don't like it's that. It's kind of like if Too you have a, if you have a box, a tub full full of rocks, it's going to be full. You can't put any more rocks in. Yeah. But then you can pour a ton of water in. Yeah. And it's, it's still the same. Still the same. So, I mean, yes, is it more weight, but it doesn't really yeah. affect you. It don't affect it. But it's like tiddly when it's when you're eating food. When I do pizzas, uh, burgers, everything, spaghetti, everything sits in your stomach differently. So you know, spaghetti kind of compacts even more. So naturally, by weight, you can do more of that. That's just a fun fact that useless information you might not want to know. <laughs> I can say that I've had my fill of fried rice tonight. Yeah? <laughs> yes, that was like six, seven plates, I think. There was a lot of fried rice. Well, speaking of fried, is this- I don't even know if we got it all on camera. I'm, I think I forgot to turn it on when I did the first rice. Did you? I, I don't know that I had that filmed. The first original round of rice we didn't eat uh -huh. that I ate later. Well, I might have to get it from my footage. If I'm I got it, I might have just We'll figure it out. I just saw this. You looked at me like I grabbed your blow, bowls. I don't know. So we have tempura banana, and we have Look. sweet dough, and we have three different kinds of ice cream, vanilla, chocolate, and strawberry. And These I are actually had an extra. I, didn't got, I told her I didn't want to waste it. Just keep it here. We got an extra one. This is all the desserts they have in the menu. So we'll give it a try. 
I know before I start, I'm probably going to say that tempura, last, so tempura banana is my favorite. So I would say that last of all of them. Okay. You know what I do with uh, with these though at a buffet? I do pudding. I dip these in pudding. Oh, with vanilla that pudding. I don't know why. I just have to do that. I I probably never get these at a buffet. No. Yeah. Just all the sugar on it, which is what it is. But um, I'm not a sweet person. Like, this is really going to be sweet. It's not that. It's not that sweet though. No, it's not. No. I always thought these were like sickening sweet. No, it's just, it's just a coating. It's just like a fried dough ball. That's why I dip it in pudding. This would go well with pudding. No, try it next time. Shot me out. Or even like a sauce jar of ice cream. Oh, you, know, I can, I can, I can, you can try half of it if you want. Mm. No, okay. I call these cafeteria ice creams because mm -hmm. when I was in school, that's what we got. Out of these flavors, what flavor do you like the most? I'm gonna say I'm gonna like the vanilla the best. I know we'll I see. do. We'll try it. I know I do. Everybody, you heard it here first. I am racist when it comes to ice cream. I'm racist when it comes to ice cream. I like vanilla ice cream. Well, I'm gonna say that's gonna be my favorite, so I'll try that last. If I'm getting annoyed with ice cream and it still holds out. Chocolate's my least favorite. Chocolate's my ice cream. All right. And cereal too, it's overpowering. I'll go with chocolate first then too. <laughs> wow, I've been in the cafeteria in a while. I can't figure out how to open it. Oh, you know what? When I do order these, like on a buffet, I, I, before my last plates, I get these, let them sit on the table a little bit, and then mm -hmm. eat my food and let them, and I put a little soda in each one of them. To, uh, to soften them all up. Oh, look at you. It used to me, chocolate is just too overpowering for me. It's strong. Chocolate is definitely strong. I think everybody probably had these before. If they've been to a buffet, especially recently since uh, yeah, COVID. These, this stuff has become real popular. Like this, all these single serving containers. A lot of places here don't even have these, like they're they're running out. Like I went to one buffet the last three or four times, they never had them. It's got to make it easier on them though. Just yeah. grab it, grab the it. Yeah. I think they might start going to that. Because I heard McDonald's ice cream machine is always down. Yeah. Ooh. Whatever. I don't know what's happening. I am getting brain freeze. Well, we say you have to have a brain to freeze, so I don't get it. I don't know when's the last time I've had brain freeze. I don't know it's my body temperature. I'm just too too hot. Ooh. That's only four ounces of ice cream, and I, my roof, of my mouth is frozen. Oh, go to um. You don't want to do the Italian ice at CJ's in Las Vegas when we go. No? No. They have shaved, I have three different kind of ice cream. One's shaved ice, it's like needles. No. I'm not lying. I didn't have your brain freeze. And they give you a cold, cold glass of water. You get one cold out the refrigerator. They oh. won't give you, they, yeah, you can't do no, no other Now nothing. see this one, maybe that chocolate one was the one they brought over last. This was, yeah. Because this is much softer than. This is softer. Yeah. I don't know. No, they, they came out the same. The only thing we had to do, mine was hard. No, the chocolate one. One, she only brought one chocolate last, so one was sitting on the table. I know. Both of mine was hard. Both of them are, mine and Andrew's. You heard it here now. Chocolate holds cold. Probably not true. I like the consistency of this, though. This is good. Yeah, I, usually I, like if, the, I like the strawberry better than the chocolate. Usually, if they don't have vanilla, I go for the strawberry. I see no brain freeze on the strawberry. Maybe it's just chocolate ice cream. I'm going to tonight. Okay. Vanilla. 
This is harder. Oh, vanilla by far. Yeah, it's not even close. No, always. I would like a vanilla. Even the cheap vanillas in the store, like these are cheap vanillas, but I like that. Like a, it's a vanilla bean taste to me. Ooh. Good. Yeah, so that, definitely the chocolate. I mean, the vanilla is my favorite over that the uh, sweet dough as well. So yeah, vanilla is my favorite. Sweet dough is my last on the on the, on the desserts. Even um, you like chocolate ice cream better than sweet dough? That's a tie. Maybe a tie. Mm, hey. All right, last thing. I never had this though. Tempura banana. Oh, yeah, that warm. Well, it's my first time having this. This is pretty good. Yeah, it is good. I've never had this before either. It was surprising to me. Yeah, but, but I, I really like bananas, so. Uh -huh. mm. That one video you did. My, my battery's dark. Uh oh. You gotta hurry up. Well, do you wanna just go ahead and. Oh, yeah, two pieces left. And we're going to have another dessert. This is a uh, spring roll. A spring roll? Yeah. They you got spring rolls? Yeah, another dessert. Just in case, thank you, just in case you run out. This has been uh, Saki Endless Sushi and Hibachi. In South Haven. We're in South Haven, Mississippi. <laughs> we're in South Haven, Mississippi, and this is in sake, endless sushi, and hibachi. I can't say enough good stuff here. I, I don't know if I've ever had this many different items from uh, a restaurant before. This is quite an experience. It was really good to try everything. My personal favorite was, of course, the spring rolls, salmon, hibachi, and crab ragoon were, were my top choices. How about you, Brandon? Um, I'm gonna go definitely with this. Definitely with this right here. That salmon was freaking amazing. Of all the entrees, the salmon was number one. Uh, what else number three I liked? The salt and pepper shrimp. Mm. I like that. You like that? That was good. That was the top ones I liked. I liked them all. But. But yeah, these are just our favorites. Yep. If you're ever in the area, please give them a try. Now switching over to Brandon's camera. If you're ever in the area, please give them a try. It's $21.99. It's so well worth it. They literally make everything to order for you. So thanks for coming to another video. Make sure you check out Brandon's channel. I'll link him in the description below. See you guys again soon. All right, and I'm just going to go ahead and keep that in there maybe. But they can check my channel out again if they want since they're already watching this one. No, but uh, I want to appreciate Bob for uh, for coming to this uh, restaurant with me. Um, we are leaving for Dallas here tomorrow. So this is our uh, Bon Voyage meal. Um, and we have plenty of uh, videos coming out on the Dallas trip. And then he invited me for the Las Vegas trip. So hopefully I'm still invited after the Dallas trip. We're going to be we'll together for, <laughs> for six days or so. So uh, we'll take turns sleeping in the car so we don't get on each other's nerves. <laughs> Yeah, so uh, yeah, it's going to be a fun trip, but I really appreciate you guys watching this video, and uh, until next time, please look in the links below for uh, Bob's uh, channel, and uh, until next time. I should probably make sure that recorded. Hey, thanks for watching the video again. If you haven't visited my website yet, um, the the address is www.DougGarbageDisposalStore.com. You can navigate through the top, all these links right here. Um, there is actually a question and comment form. If you have any questions or comments, 
uh, fill that out and it'll go straight to my email. At the very bottom, there is a free newsletter. Just sign up for right here um, and you will get a weekly newsletter. So uh, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, what are you waiting on? Hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, hit see all so you get all the notifications and don't miss the videos. Please comment. I like to um, listen to your comments uh, and respond to you. So I do like to interact with you guys. Uh, Please share the video with your friends, family, even your boss, and have a great day unless you meet other plans.